right down the line. That's a fair ball, and that's going to score the lead run as the Wildcats take the lead as Zach Arnold comes through with an RBI double right down the third baseline. So two outs, runner at second base, Javon Shelby to face Anderson. And Shelby greets him with a shot down the left field line. That's going to go to the wall. That'll play another run. And the Wildcats have themselves a 3-1 to one lead as Shelby picks up the RBI. Hand to these kids. And you remember in college, resilient. Absolutely. <laughs> play all day. <laughs> There's a, a wild pitch. Well, another thing to add to that, too, uh Oh, Jeff. that got through. Yep, plates the run because Duggett went out of the field of play. Catcher couldn't get there quick enough, and it goes right down the steps, so Shelby's able to score from second base. He's had some quality swings at these at-bats. And there's another one. He drives that wow. to deep right center field. I don't know if the center fielder can make the play. He does. Over the <laughs> shoulder by Bear. I'll tell you what, this outfield, man, they can run down some baseballs, can't they? That is outstanding right there. Wow. I thought that name was familiar. Winchester, Kentucky went to Clark County High School or George Rogers Clark. Uh-oh, got him leaning. And they picked him off. Nice play by Logan Salo to get out of the inning by picking off Pokey Harris. But it was a ball. Salo goes full here, and that time he rings him up, does Asher. It's pitched by Salo. And he comes right back with the high heat, and he swings right through it, does Yoder, and that's two strikeouts now for Salo here. Ball, a chopper over to Javon Shelby. He gobbles it up, fires on the first base, and the Wildcats victorious. As Logan Salo finishes it out, four to three, the Wildcats are winners.